You know what I hate? It's not the fact that I have my sweater in the washing machine right now, and the fact that I'm having to wear this old jacket sweater that it has a suspicious weird white stain right there you camera guy can you see that well like, like did, did you do this did you did you like you know have a little of your juices spill all over my my sweater I you know let's let's not let's not talk about that Jerry okay die yo you don't you drop the camera it's my camera guy Jerry anyways where was I it's not the fact that I have to wear this jacket or having a camera guy pointing this camera in my face. It's the fact that the devil face... Here, give me the camera. It's, it's the fact that uh, devil face put a bomb right by my console. Alright? Not only that, but discovering that that bomb was in fact manufactured by the Chaos Insurgency. You see, the chaos insurgency is sort of a threat to the foundation, right? Not only that, I discovered that through the, some of the files I've been digging up, don't ask me where I got them, the devil face has been working with the chaos insurgency. So, I decided not only have I destroyed base 16, one of the most prominent bases in all of the insurgency's history, but I decided, you know what? It's time for a little payback. That's right. We're gonna go back to New York State and wipe out all the little hideouts and outposts that the Chaos Insurgency has. Ok, 
Москве. Is it just me, or all these bad guys look exactly like me? This is getting weird. Or maybe it's the budget's going down. Shoot. This is unacceptable. Absolutely unacceptable. From all of you. We are down to one position. Hideout 17, here. And somehow we have lost all of our outposts and all of our hideouts in and around the New York State area. Not to mention the loss of one of our sophisticated and top secret bases. Base 16. How on earth it was destroyed? How on earth we have lost a clone replica weaponized version of SCP-999 is beyond me. Dr. El Guado Salvador. somehow have been mutilated, lost his hand, and has gone crazy. He keeps babbling on about a man in a sweater. He's about my height. Ill-mannered, and has somehow have killed our men, not to mention is possibly, possibly, at least what I think, is working with the Foundation, and has somehow has leaked evidence of where our locations are throughout this area. Now, since we are all gathered here, and we have approximately about 50 to 60 men left, I want a counter-attack on the west end of this area here in this field. I want the Foundation to know that we will stand firm here. Is that understood? Good, good. Um, off you go then. I will now speak to Conan Vex in my office area. Uh, you have your orders, as you see here. I will see you soon.
Oh, you guys are back again. Haha, <laughs> hello. Well, I guess you guys are ready to see the next chapter. The chapter where we uh, go and face Vleet himself. That's right, we're going back to that moment. Just right after we fought Scrap Heap on my ship with the sword and all. Anyways, here's the chapter. You have something for me? You may have heard of me as Devilface, but you also have heard of my boss, Cardin Vex. He wishes to do some more business with you, Stog. Ooh. Thank you, Devilface. Cardin Vex and his Tilt Thatch Hydra have been excellent individuals to work with for the stog. I am overjoyed and don't even have the words to express how I feel. Not to mention all the other stog in this ship. Vleet will be pleased. Of course you understand why he can't be here in person. I understand. After all, Cardin Vex was also messed up by Tor Forlax as well. Also, me too as well. And not to mention your boss, Vleet. Anyways, you can contact us on that signal. Anyways, we will be in touch. See ya. Good. Off with you then. Someone's using all devices to send a distress beacon. I'm on my way. Understood. I've been here before. Like I 
recognize this wall. Either way, I'm gonna take care of these stog. Oh, wait, one second here. Hold up. Brought this for special occasions. Read the sign. All right, it's con time. Schwarzenegger. Remember the part where they go in the future and you see one of these T-800s with a gun? Well, I'm the T-800 and these guys are like the humans. Did they get you in the eye? Damn. All right. They're all dead. I got maybe what? couple of minutes before another stock ship arrives if any of them hit this distress beacon or anything oh. <sighs> all right I gotta see who sent the distress signal I'm going to check over here. <sighs> All right. All right. Detention level. Bomb level. All right. Don't have to go up top. Good, good, good. God, stupid wires. Ooh, don't mind me. Big giant hammer. Uh, this thing's useless, anyways. Disable the ship. 